Hey everyone, this is Jillian here with a quick tutorial to get you started with DevKit in the built-in render pipeline. Create a new 3D project via the Unity Hub. In the Package Manager, click the Add icon and select Add Package from Disk. Locate the DevKit Core Package folder. Within this folder, select the package.json file and click Open. Once imported, you will see the addition of DeathKit Core within the Package Manager. Select this item and expand the Samples toggle. Import the available DeathKit Core prefab. This will import a prefab that is pre-configured for your project with built-in RP. In the Project window, go to your Assets folder, select the DeathKit Clip plus Core built-in RP look, and drag it into the hierarchy to populate your scene. This prefab has everything you need to play back a DeathKit Clip with a photo look and built-in RP. Now we just need our footage. Back in the project window, create a new folder under Assets. You can do this by right-clicking in the project window and selecting Create Folder. I like to name this folder Clips. This will hold your DeathKit video files, metadata text files, and the optional poster images. You can simply drag these assets into your Clips folder. Select your recently created DeathKit clip. In the inspector, you will notice that the clip component is alerting you that the clip is not set up. No worries. We just need to link up our DeathKit assets. In the DeathKit clip component, drag over the metadata and poster image. Under Video Player, drag your DeathKit video to the Video Clip field. The poster image is optional, so if you'd like to disable this, simply select the Advanced Settings toggle and disable poster image. Now your clip is ready to play and you're all set to build your scene in built-in RP.